Happy Thursday, everyone. We talked to Zeke Metz about how SWIM is doing so far. I'm Kara. And I'm Addison, and this is your daily news. La, 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 la. Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, the evening TV. Everybody eventually says that they're as lost as you. There will be a winter sports pep is will meet tomorrow at 2.40 in the South Gym. Friday is the last day to turn in your enrollment form to the front office. There will be an improv show tonight at Topeka West. This is their first time event at 7 p.m. Tickets are $2. If you would like to create a design online to be sold at the Norris Nook or work at the school store, contact Mr. Tinsley for details. There will be a fine arts showcase and variety show on February 1st. The show begins at 7 p.m. Pick up an application from C2 or the counselor's office for financial aid scholarships for yearbooks. These are due February 14th. Outside day forums are available. Freshmen see Mrs. Naylor and 10th through 12th graders see Mrs. Varner. Now let's go and check out the results for Scholars Bowl. In the criminal justice system, excessive hallway behavior is considered heinous. In Seaman High School, the hallway patrol is an elite squad catching the criminals in action. Stop! It doesn't take a traffic guard to know how to walk through a hallway. Don't run. Don't stop. Walk appropriately. That was a terrible shot. It wasn't that bad of a shot. Come on, just go throw your trash away. You don't need to pick it up. There's a reason we have janitors. It's only a few steps away. Just go pick it up. Don't be a fool. Throw your trash away at school. The JV Scholars Bowl team finished first place this week. All males interested in playing tennis this spring, please attend the informational meeting tomorrow after school at 3.15 in the Commons. Whiteout is the theme for Friday's basketball game. The swim team has been doing well this season. Let's go learn more about it. What's going on, Vikes? I'm here with Zeke Mechts to talk about the swim team and how their season's going to go. So how is your season going so far? Uh, so far, our season's going really well. Uh, we're undefeated. Uh, we've been defeating teams by margins of like 150, 200, 100. So yeah, it's pretty, going pretty well, I would say. All right, where is state and what time does it start? Uh, state is at the Capitol Federal Natatorium. Uh, it is, prelims are February 16th and finals are the 17th. And uh, it's going to be sometime in the morning. They don't know yet though. All right, and how do you think you and your team will do? Um, we are definitely looking for a top three finish. Uh, I think we're going to surprise some people when we get there. Uh, we'll have to see, though, when we get there, though. All right, and how do you hope to end the season? Uh, I hope that we end the season with no regrets, say that we left it all out there in the pool, and uh, hopefully, hopefully come away uh, feeling good about things. All right, thank you very much. Now I'll set back to your anchors. The swim team will be competing tonight at the City Invitational at the 501 Auditorium. Now we're to care with the weather. Good afternoon, Vikes. It's currently 55 degrees and tonight I'll stay about the same with sunny weather. For a three-day forecast, you have highs in the 50s and 40s and lows in the 20s, and it's going to get a little cloudy. Today in history is Alicia Keys' birthday, and it's National Opposite Day. <laughs> all right, now back to your anchors. <laughs> That's all we have for today, Vikes. Make sure you enjoy the warmer weather. Just bounce it. 